Yep. Oh, he missed it. I think that was a yellow. Because it was like a thunk and nothing home. Yep. Oh, he caught it. He caught it on the on the on the bounce back. This one feels decent. Feels pretty decent. Good head shakes. Big head shakes. I'm hoping this is a crappie. What is a smallmouth? Might be a bass. Oh my god, what is that? Tell me that's a white perch, please. Oh dude, it's a staven white perch. Absolute staver of a white perch. <laughs> Look at that staven white perch. Giant white perch. Lippable white perch. <laughs> Look at that thing. That is a monster. Crazy hard to catch. There's a, oh, they're gone. So I don't have to worry too much about it, but that's a white perch guys. If you guys don't have these where you live, they're kind of like a striped bass. Um, one of the best by far eating fish in the state of Maine, but this is a big one. I'll put him on the scale for you, or at least on the measuring board. What's up guys, Joe Holland here. Gonna try something out for the first time. I'm in my shop, I got plugs everywhere, but I wanna try something new for me is one, I wanna try an electric fillet knife that's battery operated, no plugs at all. I don't ever run electric uh, fillet knives anyway. And I wanna try vacuum sealing some fish and that's actually battery operated, no plugs at all on that either. So I'm pretty pumped for both these. I'm gonna test them out here in the shop so that way I know if they work and I know how to work them before I get on the hard water on these trips because it's going to be awesome to be able to vacuum seal stuff on the water and bring it home. That's the um, that's the electric fillet knife. It's just a China deal. Um, I'll throw a link to it on Amazon for you if you want. And this is the vacuum sealer. This one's made by an Alaskan company called Packback. And as you can see, no cables at all. There's a 18-volt uh, battery right in there. Let's try it out.
Yeah, I don't know. That was my first time using an electric knife. Electric flame knife. Seemed to work pretty good, pretty easy. I can see how it would be a benefit for a lot of fish when you're doing a whole pile of them or a bucket full. But I like that it's cordless. It's got a 12-volt uh, battery, lithium. Well, I'll be. <laughs> Look. No way. Look at that, all sealed up. That was crazy easy, holy cow. So both those things you just saw were battery operated, not plugged in. I'm here in my shop, I got plugs everywhere, but I wanted to test it out and see, cause I'm gonna take this stuff out on the ice with me and I'm gonna take it out camping. And there you go, there's a vacuum sealed package of white perch and crappy. I'm going to get that to Donnie for tomorrow. I guess I could have gone a little bit lower. I've never vacuum sealed anything even plugged in, so that was the first time. But there it is. Super cool. Super, super cool. That one is made by Packback. It's, a, I guess, an Alaskan company. But that's the vacuum sealer, battery operated. It's portable. I'll see if I can throw a link in the description for you. But you're going to see that out on the ice this year for sure.